Good evening. We start tonight with a road trip south to Pittsburgh. UE Local 506 and 618 members taking their strike to the WabTech headquarters outside Pittsburgh while Erie's union president meets with company officials in mediation. Samir Nefsi reports from the Pittsburgh location. Samir. Just nine days into the UE Local 506 and 618 strike against WAB Tech, picketing around all 10 entrances to the former GE site, and now more than 50 union members packing up and heading to Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania to the headquarters of WAB Tech, all in the midst of mediation sessions. Who are we? Who are we? We have a big voice in Erie, but we also want to go ahead and have our voice known down here. More than one week of chanting and standing in solidarity at the Erie Wab Tech location, and now more than 50 men and women packing a bus, and some even driving their own vehicles to travel more than 130 miles to make their voices heard against the imposed mandatory overtime and wage cuts. We didn't ask for this. They came in swinging, and they're disappointed that we're fighting. The timing for the commute to Pittsburgh comes as UE Local 506 President Scott Slauson is meeting with Wab Tech and a mediator to try to resolve the strike. UE Local 506 releasing this statement in part saying, Our goals are the goals of workers across America. We are united as a community and now as a region. Members from Unifor driving from Toronto, Canada to stand with UE members. When our brothers and sisters, when we get the call, we, we come out and we support them. Coates is saying this is something her union members have faced before. We're all in this together and we're all fighting corporate greed. We, we fought it in many of our workplaces and, uh, and I know that our brothers and sisters here are doing the same. Union members saying they will continue to fight for what's not only fair, but what is right. In Pittsburgh, Samir Nefsi, Jet 24 Action News. Thank you, Samir, for that report.